Hey you guys, what's going on? What do you do that for? What's up? What's up you guys? Oh. Okay. Yeah. What's up guys? We're here. I'm trying to get both of us in. I don't want to be in. I'm driving. <laughs> okay, I guess I'm Judy's doing the driving. Taking a breather. You guys have no idea what I'm just preparing. About to go race car race racing guys. Okay, we're about to you go guys. racing. We've been sitting here planning what we are what we're about to do. Did you guys read the title? How many of you guys read the title? Let us know. I bet I bet only like about two of you guys read the title. Other people are just like, oh, they're live, here I come. This coffee is not working. This water What's up, Perla? Coffee. Perla. <sighs> Sorry for all that jerkiness. All we're that sitting jerking. in a parking lot trying to figure out the plan. And here's the plan. We're, we're getting ready to go do something. Um, so we're in California right now. And we are going to go check out a couple groomers. And can, you, can you repeat that? Can you repeat that to the camera? Hey, hey. Did you guys read the comments? I mean, the title? Can you think about it for a minute? Can you think about I can't, you... man. I'm just hyped up. I'm hyped up, okay? 100 hyped up? <laughs> what does that 100, mean? 100? And I'm having 100. to deal with this guy, this man here. Oh, gosh. If you guys only knew, man. Donna. Donna's out there. Donna, what's up? Perla, what's up? What's are you Keo, are you out there? We're here in California, girl. <laughs> we could be visiting you right now. Anyway, um... <clears throat> we're in North California and this is the home of YouTube so we've done some little bit of studying in uh, in California I would think that YouTube uh, was designed they're talking about your haircut yeah it's nice huh that's a California this fade. is a California fade uh, at this place called fade away fade away check them out if you need a fade they are the best LB use him or use uh, Phil, Phil. Phil at Fade Away, and that's... Uh, LB did my head, though. It's actually me. in Hercules, California. Hercules, so. California. If you need a fade, go there. Tell them Didi with My Favorite Groomer sent ya. Uh, that's a quick shout-out. He didn't even ask for that, but... He runs his own business. He's got a really uh, good hand on. And I asked him. I asked him as a barber. I said... <clears throat> I said, are you... Because he said he'd been uh, doing hair for 15, 16 years, just like me, right? Except for not dog hair. And then I said... Uh, He's been running his own store for nine years. He's the owner. And I said, how's your hands doing? He goes, yeah, I'm feeling it. I said, is it because scissors or, or the clipper? He goes, because the clipper. Oh, really? So that is exactly the truth. The grown man, he's been doing head hair, human head hair. That's a man, too. A man can and take And a man more. told me that. A man said, uh, I said, are you feeling it yet in your hand? And he said, yes, I am. And I said, are you feeling it because of the scissoring or because of the clippers? And he said, because of the clipper. He goes, I definitely feel it. So those of you guys out there that don't want to spend the extra on the Andis 5-speed and the one that we sell, so you know you got one straight from Andis, I challenge you to rethink it and get the Andis 5-speed. It's, in my opinion, one of the lightest clippers that is designed to do heavy-duty work. It is not like um, what I have been told. It's not like the wall bravura where I have been told by someone who sharpens the blade, not sharpens because you got to replace them, but who replaces the wall clippers and treat, you know, service them. He said, Didi, people, groomers use the bravura in the wrong way. The bravura is not made. He, he, he told me this. He goes, the bravura is not made for heavy duty haircutting, but that's what you guys are using it for. And I'm like, I don't use it for that. If I'm going to use a bravura, right, on our demo, we use it for face feet sanitary. You never see me do a shave down with a bravura because the power is not really there for it. It's not designed for that. You can do it all day long, but that, that's why you end up having so much servicing done on your wall bravuras, in my opinion. 
So get a really good clipper, and that's why we have them on Andis Five Speed on my website, myfavoritegroomer.com. If you order from us, we order directly from Andis. If you're ordering some that, somewhere else, I cannot guarantee you what you're getting. So we are on our way right now. We're gonna head out. Uh, we have about one hour. My prediction is we have one hour. One hour live stream. Live stream or less. And so we need to get on the road. We're gonna go to our first groomer. I need a place to groom out of while I'm out here in California once a month. And if we can't make it work, we're gonna drop California. So I'm about to use this cell phone and drive out here. So I'm gonna focus on this. Dave is gonna chit chat with you guys. He might show you kind of the surroundings and stuff like that. California is beautiful. California is the home of YouTube. That's where YouTube was born. So uh, anywhere you're in a public place, I'm not a lawyer, but anywhere you're in a public place, you can record. I believe California is a two-party state for voice Doesn't record. matter. Go on. Go on. Move on. Do your... Okay, he doesn't want me to tell you this stuff. So anyways, we've they done a little research. Know. They and don't we... need to learn. They don't need to know if that stuff. If you want to learn about what you can and cannot do, go study. Go call a lawyer. I'm a lawyer. Who's that? Who's that says that? So here we go. We're going to go Stay out here. Stay in California. Are you in California? We're going to go check out this first groomer. I need a place to groom, and the only way to find a good place to groom is to go, go show up. If it's dirty, nasty, smelly, mean, uh, you know what I mean? You'll know it when you show up. Walk in. Check it out. We're going to go straight here. Shivis. Listen to the car I rented, man. Okay, I'm going to focus, man. Focus on your stuff here. So we're going to talk right here. I don't know what what do you guys want to see. Do you guys want to see my face or do you guys want to see um... the surroundings or? Why don't you ask them some questions? We got forty eight people, nine likes. Okay, so I, I guess you guys don't want us here. <laughs> We're always saying the same stuff. Gosh, man. Uh, if you want to buy stuff, email me. Um, we're not at a computer, so you're going to have to do some research yourself. You just need to go to myfavoritegroomer.com. You can contact us through the website and everything. All, that's, all the information we talk about is there at your fingertips. So make sure you go and do a little bit of research. That tells me you're serious. Go to myfavoritegroomer.com and just start there. Uh, if you email me, then I can email you a tool list. It gives you my opinions and... Uh, what I think would work and just gives you, opens up your mind. It's a really long email of tools and stuff like that. As we see that, Perla. We still see that you're a member. Thank you, Perla. We see those stars next to that symbol. The stars tell us how long you've been doing it, girl. Thanks for being a member. We miss you on the gaming, man. I don't know if you're just too busy. She's too busy with the baby, man. <laughs> I don't know if you're just too busy, man. Just put that... Put that TV in the in the baby room so the baby can grow up knowing who we are too, and you know we can all be one big family. <laughs> oh yeah, that would be awesome. <laughs> the baby's like, is that Dee Dee on TV right now? Yeah, cool. Who's she grooming today, Mama? The baby's you gonna know? be crying, Dee Dee, Dee Dee. No. I'm playing. Stop that. I don't like that. I don't like you saying that. <laughs> okay, you guys want to see? Um, nobody asked. Nobody answered. If you guys want to see out there or our face. So how many of you guys are from California right now? Answer. Uh, go on the super chat. Make sure you close the super chat. Smash the like button, please. You can even share it on your social media right now. Just say, oh my gosh, I can't believe my favorite groomer is in California. And she's going to arrive randomly at groom shops. Who does that? Are you a groomer that's done that? I don't think so, right? No, right? Yes or no? Have you just showed up at... A groom shop and just said hey I just want to see what's going on in here have you done that as a groomer you might learn some stuff you might learn not how to not talk you might learn how to clean you might learn some organization skills if you go walk into a groomer and go oh my goodness I have There's walked into a there. lot of groom shops with the dog upstand so I've seen a lot I have, I have seen a lot Groomers are running uh, their businesses all different kinds of ways, and the only way you're going to be ever see, you know, someone out there is by uh, making that move. Go, go drive around, take a day off, take one of your days off, and go hit up two or three groomers. Why not? You know what I mean? Why not? I think that's moving too fast for you guys on the on the right, so I have to keep you guys forward. 
forward to the right a little bit, baby. Forward to the right, you know, like and don't and nobody out there be a crap person and be calling people because of their license plate number, please. Be we'll cool. just try to keep it back, and then when we get close, look over here at the stores. Be David. cool. Don't be a crap person. <laughs> Anyways, license plates is public information. Why? Why is it such a? Yeah, but somebody, somebody's bound to be like, hey, they have your license plate. Oh, I got your phone number. Oh, you're, you're freaking you know? stupid, man. Is that the, that's how much time you have on your hands? Well, somebody's you bound to just do that. Just, you might be, no, I better take that back. You must be on some kind of like not working. By the way, it's not sponsored ad with all these ads out there. Businesses, it's just business names. JC Penny right there. There's nothing to see pretty much, guys. There's just buildings, man. It's like Mikio. But look at the weather, man. Look at the sky, how clear it is. The temperature is nice. We got the AC, it's 70 degrees. We got the AC on because we want to try to keep the camera as cool as possible. If the camera goes hot, we're going to lose you guys. So that's happened before. Um, I tried to do an air show out here in California. That did not work over very well. The flight line was extremely hot, and uh, I could not get the YouTube feed at all up. I ended up like with three YouTube feeds, and I had to delete them all. But it just wouldn't run. If it's hot, it's not going to work. If your electronics get hot, it's not going to work. There goes um, palm trees, little palm trees. It's like, what's that guy doing? No. <laughs> that guy's actually putting poison on his plants. Oh. He's on his wall and everything too. On his wall and everything. We've seen two guys doing that already. Carrying in that poison. That the, oh, I don't know if it's poison. We're assuming. Welding. And we're carrying that uh, spray stuff on their back. I, I don't know that that's good for you. Chastity, Lee Rowley, thanks for the 10. Woohoo! You're awesome. Who did that? Lee Rowley. So what did you say Chastity for? Chastity's there. Hi, Chastity, and then Lee Rally, thank you for the 10. Appreciate that. Throw any donations out there. If you are happy we're on, you can donate to support the feed. You watch all the time. You're a big fan. Isn't this awesome, guys? It, is is NBC5 going to have you driving around their city? No. They're going to report the news they want you to see, right? Yep. Sorry, and they're, NBC5. And they're going to be like, man. Um, Hurry. I remember one, they came out to talk about uh, a company called Beyond the Rainbow, and they were like, okay, that's it. And they took like five words, and that's what they put out there. They didn't put out anything else. All right, man, get a look. This is, uh, we're getting ready to get close to this first groomer. If the first groomer is not in a public place, we're not going to be able to. Yeah, it has to be a public place. If it's house, we'll probably won't do it. If it's a person's house, we will not knock on the door. It looks like, I say that because it looks like we're going to uh home neighborhood here we'll see here in a minute oh you guys see that nice truck right there Ooh, Ooh ford it's like a 68 ford oh that too one two dang they got a mattress in their yard too man oh look at all that wood all those pellets man oh he got a sub sitting outside oh i don't know what are we in the hood right now i don't know what hood means and we'll just take that back we'll take that back. the hood the hood the hood means Happy on open door. <laughs> uh, hood could mean it's having. My, it, this is my personal opinion. If you guys don't open. agree, if you guys don't agree with my personal opinion about being in the hood, then you guys have your own opinion. So, yeah. Ooh, look at the three hundred. Yeah. That's oh, awesome. Ooh, big wheels. Big wheels. wheels. I want some big wheels. We're getting close to this place. It does look like it's in a. Uh, a get your get your riding it's high. Not in a house. I don't know what you're talking about, David. Big wheels. I'm talking about big wheels. It gets oh, you get riding you high. Get yeah, you, yeah, yeah, yeah. Get That's you riding true. high. Okay. Okay. Like we a, made a turn towards a business scenario here. Like a uh, oh, like a truck. Like a truck. You're you're feeling high up up like a truck. Tall. There oh, you go. This? Tall. Grooming, there it is. Fantasy nails. No, go get no. Your, go get your nails, dude. Okay, David, what are you talking about, man? <laughs> What's that? Grooming nails. Oh, there it is. Oh, Ooh. and the door is wide open, you guys. The awesome. The door is wide open, which means it's definitely public. All right. God, man. <laughs> what van? 
Okay, here we go, guys. Oh, snap. Hmm. This is not bad. I don't like the location very much. It's outdoor. Like, it's in the back, back, back of the subdivision thing. Layla said, get your hair done. Get your hair done. <laughs> okay. All right, let me see here. I always have a business card, so let me get a business card out. See, McKeel said, and you are in the hood. I live in Cali. <laughs> <laughs> All right, got some business cards here. I'm gonna grab a couple here. I'm gonna grab my notebook. David's gonna be on point with the recording. I'm gonna try to and, be on uh, point, guys. It's gotta be a, both of us need to talk when we get in there. So, I gotta get the keys. Got my business card. Did not bring any dog upstand postcards. And, um, <laughs> all right, you guys ready for this? Let's go try it out. Let's go see if this is, uh, it looks nice from the outside. Uh, she's got four star reviews, very little. It says she got about 20 years experience. So all we can do is just go in and find out. Let's go. We got we can one do, hour guys. time limit. Okay. Hi. Hey, uh, are you the owner? Yes. Uh, I'm interested in, I actually come to California about once a month, and I'm looking for a place to clean out of. Is that something maybe we can discuss later when you're not home? Um, you know what, at this time, yeah, I'm not interested. Not interested. Okay, I'll leave my card here. You can check us out on YouTube. You'll see your feet on there. Thanks. Uh, Shut down, bro. Shut down. Did you get a view, though? Yeah, I did. What'd you get? Got everything. Scare that guy, he shut his door. Oh, uh, that guy, yeah. <laughs> that guy over there shut his door. It's so funny how people get so uh, what is it, uptight, man. Did you guys see her reaction? She's like, Don't do it rude. I'm not trying to do it rude. You have to actually talk pretty fast. Did you see her face? She already wanted to ask me to leave as soon as she saw his camera. Yeah, did you guys not see that? Don't, what is that? I'm listening. For real, geez. Let me tell you guys, I've been doing this a long time. I have gone to groom, sh groom shops in Guam, Hawaii, California, Texas, all over Texas. Um, they all do this to me, all of them. Every groomer, I have very, uh, I have to honestly play this like, yeah girl, I know what you mean, man. I hate, you know what I mean? I have to play this role to get a, on their good side. I have to be on their side in order for them to hear what I have to say. And I'm not selling anything. I'm actually offering her an opportunity. Remember we talked about this? I, I'm offering you a fucking opportunity that not everyone gets. And if you say no, that's on you, man. That's a blessing that you might've just said. It, to blow her business up on YouTube, I would be like, you're on YouTube? Girl, let me put my dog up. I need to talk to you. We need to talk. You know what I'm saying? Okay, next one. You can't, some people you can't help, and I'm not here to help her. I'm here to find a freaking grooming salon that I can groom out of once a month that I don't have to go rent for 3000 a month when I'm only here for two weeks. You know what I mean? People don't know what, people don't know what's looking right in front of their face. So at this point, this is what I do. I get my notebook out and I write down exactly what happened for me. I would say grooming Dells, um, not happy. I'm just going to go not happy. Didn't want to talk. She was the owner. I said, are you the owner? She said she was the owner. She had, she was, looked like she was working by herself, nice and quiet with the door open. And, but I saw one, two, three, four, just, okay. I'm doing all this other stuff. I'm, I'm talking. How many dogs did you guys see I think I saw one, two, three, like four, five, five and then uh, one on the table. So that's six dogs, five in a cage. Give her one stars. We can't do that because we do not get yeah. services from them. I can't leave her that neither can you, you know, do the right thing here. I might go, I might leave her, I might go leave her uh, three stars. Or, I, this is what I would do. I honestly, did you see how clean it was? It was yeah, clean. It was pretty clean. It was real clean. And I have seen some really dirty places. And it didn't stink. Didn't stink. Um, and it was quiet. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, for all we care, all those dogs have been the same owner. So this is how a, a business owner analyzes. 
analyzing the situation. I'm not judging her, but I do know she cut me off, right? It she does look fairly new, though. Like, yeah, why would her. it look new, though, when you guys should see some of the reviews? Um, I told maybe, you Maybe, but, but look, check this out. The last review was one year ago. Maybe it got bought out, and she's a new owner. Mm -hmm. So I didn't even get to a chance to keep going with some questions because honestly, she's got a dog on the table. And y'all know me, <laughs> clean or not, she was rude. They well, meant, I'm pretty rude too. No, they, so. meant, they meant they were saying that she was rude, not you. Let's go. Well, then maybe we should go to more than three places on YouTube because you guys are going to learn a lot right now. <laughs> uh, in my career, if I've gone to 65 groom shops, three of them are three of them are my friends. Three of them, I have their number in my phone and they're friends. If I've ever walked in on their salon and I actually, out of 65, I probably can say three around the world. So they're not even all like California. They're not all, you know what I mean? 65 on average, I have three three of them that were really nice to me, real cool. Yeah. Maybe even ordered supplies, maybe even picked up some stuff off of me, you know, worldwide. So uh, let me see here, the next one. This ain't nothing, man, I'm already used to this. You should see the ones we went to in Vegas. Yeah, this ain't nothing. This ain't nothing. There's some really mean, mean groomers out there. If you're, that's, this should tell you right here. This is the first time I took you guys with me. Bro, I would be, I would be like, you're on YouTube. How many followers like, do you have? Right, oh. I would be, um, right, exactly. I, I would, I would be like, shout out to, um, uh, where, where are you right now? Okay, here we go. This is a, I'm not gonna tell you the name until we pull up because I don't want anybody to sabotage. It means like call them up and say, oh. We don't want, we don't want any stream snipers over here. They're coming to see your salon, girl. You better lock that door. <laughs> if anybody you know? knows about stream snipers. <laughs> so let me tell you guys, stream snipers is like when you're live streaming a game and somebody somehow gets in your game and goes to the same spot and they snipe you because they know it's you. That's a oh, stream serious? sniper. Oh, serious? Yeah. That's pretty cool, man. People do that. It's like they're watching your live stream and they know that it's about 10 seconds ahead. So. They try to guesstimate the time you ready up, and when you ready up, for some reason, if you ready up around the same time, it'll put you in the same game. So they'll go to that same spot you're headed in the game and actually snipe you or cure you because they know it's you. That's what stream snipers are called. So this is this will be like like a stream sniper. If we show you guys the address of where we're going, somebody can be either meet us up there or call that phone number and call that business and be like, hey, they're coming, they're on the way. Shut the door. Like we're doing, or you guys can call and be like, "Hey, somebody very important is coming over there. Can you be nice to them and just?" Uh, well, we're not gonna tell you anyway. You know, so. yeah. When we get there, we'll get in there. We'll tell you we get in there. I'm going on this whole different way now. You're showing the true step. Look at that um, purple tree, guys. I'm just gonna tell you right now the way YouTube is growing. If someone walks in with a YouTube channel, just stop what you're doing and go talk for five minutes. That's an opportunity you don't know where it could go, and it could be a good one or a bad one. You just gotta feel it out. But you're not gonna know if you don't stop what you're doing and freaking figure ask. If someone came in on a, it, if the news station walked in, I would put my shit up and go, "Hey, what's up? <laughs> I want to be on the news. Please sponsor me." If you're in my salon already, you're already you're already doing something for me. If you're already recording, you're already doing something. You guys, don't forget to smash the like button. Hey, Callie, just got the message you guys are live. Sometimes I feel like late. I think we have so much subscribers and so much people notified that sometimes I think it's drags. Because it can't be like, oh, they've gone live. Let's shoot 100,000 people Yeah, that's true. It's notified. Be trickle. Yeah, it has to be trickled. Just like emails, man. You do 100,000 at one time, it's all going to be spammed out. Ooh, look at those wheels. Big Tire wheels. Depot. Big wheels. Big wheels. Okay, let's see where we're at here. We're taking a right here. 1 800 radiator. That looks pretty cool right there the center. The church thing on it? What? The tacos and uh, hot dogs? And that's the, the Saint Marie or what? Virgin Mary. Virgin Mary, thank you. That's interesting. That That's a lot of. um. Hispanic Leasing culture. now, one and two bedrooms, one month free. Ooh, Ooh. one month free. Leasing now, one one month free call. Kind of looks like a hotel. It's not outside at all. Oh shoot, I'm in the wrong lane. Bro, drive safe, bro. Keep it safe, bro. 
You guys want to go do some donuts? Oh, you guys want to do donuts in this car? <laughs> I'm always behind the wheel and I'm always acting a fool, man. Zero to 60 in four seconds. Kim's. Hey, how many of you guys were with us doing donuts? Say I, 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 I. Say I, I, I. How many I, of you were with us doing the donuts at Christmas time? Was it Christmas? No, it wasn't even Christmas time. Say I, I, don't I be, raise your hand. I don't I. be doing stuff like that, guys, because I'm part of the one that's going to get caught. <laughs> so I just stay away from doing that, and I'm part of the one that's going to lose control and hit a light pole. And I'm the one that gets to not get caught, and I'm the one doing acting a fool all the time. So that's why I don't do stuff like that. Who was out there? Say I. Who saw the uh, donuts? Wasn't that on me and me? It's a Ford Mustang. <laughs> yeah, it was on me and you gaming. Can I Wait. say I, I? Who saw the who saw the donuts? I don't remember. In the was truck? it on me and you gaming? No, it wasn't. I think. It oh was. yeah, it was. I think it was. Wait. Driving around at night. Who saw the chicken play chicken? Do you guys remember? Do you guys remember if it was on me and you gaming or this channel? Most of you guys probably have not seen it. Ooh. Can you guys hear the engine? This is a real um, engine right here. <laughs> if I didn't get a special deal, I would not, not have rented this car. I had uh, a Hyundai, okay? Yeah, so, you guys, we normally get Hyundais, but since- Is this a right turn here? It's so confusing. Hyundais. We normally get Hondas or Toyotas. That guy's in the bike lane, he's trying to cut me off. Little does he know he's not supposed to be in the bike lane. Don't pull up on the bike lane, bro. Did we miss a donation from somebody? Um, Cali, thanks for the two. Thanks for the two. Get to roll through California. What are these kids doing, man? What are you guys doing? Aren't you supposed to be in school? No, school's out for oh, summer. School. Epic, are you out here? Epic. For summer. What's this guy doing right here with his bicycle? Bro. Look at this guy with his bicycle, bro. What the? Is hey. he... <laughs> <laughs> that was fun. Is his friend riding that bike too? <laughs> Let me help you, buddy. Come ride oh, a bike shit. with me. What the? What's that guy looking at? <laughs> 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 he didn't look back. <laughs> I'm, gonna I'm gonna get shot. Man. Okay, we have a long ways to go here. It's straight stretch. He took off and left his friend, possibly, or he probably stole that bike. Come on, you don't know, David. Don't say that, man. Hey, it's my opinion. I can assume whatever I want. He could have let his girlfriend ride the bicycle home, and he rode him back home and took his other bike back home. You don't know what's going on. Yeah, to that. <laughs> or his friend could have been riding that bike. Or his friend had a flat, so he went and fixed it and he took the bike back. Man, we could keep on going. We could keep on going. Why don't we just go ask him? Why don't we go back and ask him? He want to. Should we go? <laughs> what do you guys hey, think? Should hey, we go sir, back and ask him? Why are you doing that? <laughs> My don't speak English. <laughs> That's probably the first card he'll pull. Don't speak English. He's gonna. No say. English. No English. <laughs> yeah, go back and ask. Go back and ask? Did they say go back and ask? Yeah, we would, but there's no U-turns here, guys. Yes, there is. Right now. Do you want me Bro. to? Seriously. I'm actually only going 35 miles an hour. It sounds like I'm going like, you know, what's that guy doing? He's literally going What's 30. that guy doing? What the? <laughs> oh, snap. What the? What's going on over here? Do we have time for this? I don't Do think so. Do for a U-turn? I don't think so. Dang. Just keep going. Okay, next time something funky happens, we will ask. Okay? She's only going like 30 right now. That, oh, it's you like guys can uh, see it. 30 right now. It sound, I'm, I'm making it joyful. You Arturo, guys, what's up? Sorry. Arturo from Puerto Rico. Perla just got her six month badge. I see six that. Six months? No, really? Yeah, cool. she's been a member for six We've months. We've been doing the membership thing for six months? Yeah. Wow, that's freaking awesome, man. Okay, I'm gonna go up here and take a left. You were one of the first ones, Perla. I, I, I recall, I don't know if yeah, Melissa she P. Was, Melissa P. had an issue. She's like, I was trying to do it and it wouldn't work or something like that. I recall Melissa P. being the very first one, but I don't know if she's kept it all along. Melissa P., have you kept your membership this whole time? Can you type? I can see if you type. 
Scroll up then. If you're she out did there. Type. She did type. She's not here no more. Uh, she's there. She's there. She's just working. Can't see it. It's gone and refreshed. Okay, is it this light or the next light? Next. She has to type again for me to see. <sighs> this lady. Yep, right uh, at midnight. I was a day late. <laughs> she said, it's okay. All Paul's veterinary. Oh man, hospital. what are these guys next, next to us doing? They're girls and they look like, I don't know, they're, they're not even wearing their seatbelt. Nope. They look like they're doing something wrong. They're up to something. Just don't give them any, you know, just be cool, man. Be cool. I've seen. Be like, oh, they're recording us. Let's go check it out. I've seen California. Um, Shit, man, it's this one. Go, uh, it looks like we go over the big street. Oh my gosh, look at that um, hill over there. Is that the desert? Looks like the go. desert over there, guys. We're gonna go. The Sahara Desert. Kidding. That that's actually grass. It actually looks like it's just a hill of sand, right? Oh, look at all those hills over there too. Then. Over that way. That's that hill. Uh, I'll show you right now. They got a sign spinner over there. Wa Sing Restaurant, Mongolian Bob. That's not that's not a nice sign to spin. Come on, man. You gotta have like aerodynamics. Trying to. Trying to spin it? Yeah. She's listening to some music though. She got her water. That's not a I cool sign spinner. If, if, is that minimum wage? Minimum wage here is 16 bucks, remember? If she's making 16 bucks doing that, I would do that all day. Bro, oh, she's making oh, yeah. 16 bucks an hour to do that possibly oh, yeah. if it's oh, minimum she wage. Might be getting, she might be making 20, man. What? No way. While well, we ask her. <laughs> I said the next thing we I said the next thing we have to do we'll ask. Let me ask her. She can't hear, man. Hey, uh, she, how much do you make? Yeah, she can't hear me. Hey, how much do you make? <laughs> she can't hear me with that. Hey! I don't think you're allowed to ask that, are you? Oh, we're are not you? her employer. I don't Why know. Not? Oh, here. here. She stopped. She's taking a break. Okay. okay. So somebody in California told us that minimum wage is just sixteen bucks in California. Oh, sure. so go straight we don't there. know how true that is, but that's what they said. All right. Okay. And then. Ooh, are those businesses? Oh, Dang! Wow. Look at those, man. They look like houses. Okay. <sighs> Guys, don't forget to smash the like button. Look at all this grass. Okay. Oh, well, this is actually like a memorial place, probably, because look, there's a thing sitting right there. There might be animals in there. Where? Back there. Let me see here. This is a fairly new business place, looks like it. What's that? For sale. What is this place, man? Is oh. this commercial or residential? It's like commercial. Oh, sorry. Huh. Garages. Both. Looks like both. So it could be uh, deeded for multiple, uh, multi-use. Puppy parking. I see puppy parking right there. Would it hit the curb or what? <laughs> You cannot pop curves on, on Mustangs, man. Okay. Oh my God. It's not a curve, man. It's, it's a ditch. Oh. It's a ditch. It's a ditch. I can't help it. Minimum wage in Toronto <laughs> is 14. <laughs> Puppy parking. Someone's in, there. Oh, just... oh, someone's in there and she's not busy. Oh. She is doing paperwork. Here we go, you guys. Here we go. Okay. Here we go. Are you ready? I forgot. What am I doing here? I'm kind of <laughs> I'm kind of nervous, man. It's like meeting a new person. Okay. Here we go, you guys. I can't really focus Ooh, because I can't see. Lopez is how DHPP rabies and shark.
shop and Lazy shops for grooming. Please call during daytime hours for appointment. They're closed. Wait, is this oh. the place we're looking for? Uh, Ask. Hmm. Oh, oh. This may not even be the place. Are they dog groomers? Hey, I know you. Do you? Yeah. No, you don't. I do. <laughs> what? You're on YouTube right now. We're, oh, we're with our fans. Do you have five minutes? Can we record? Uh, Say hi. Hi. <laughs> hi. <laughs> yes. Yes. So I'm just going to a few places because I'm I'm in California. Wow, this is nice. Oh my god. I actually watch you and me and the other girl that works down the road. Are you are you paying attention? Yes. Wow, I'm Dave Price. Nice to meet you. Hi, I'm this David. This is really yeah. This is really nice. Look at wow. look around. Yeah. Yeah, you can take a look around. Really? Awesome. Wow. I have a few minutes. We don't want to stay very long. We just, uh, it's okay. We don't want to interrupt because I know, you know, no, you know, I, I, know. I, don't I know. actually shared your rules because we have the exact same rules. Okay. Which is what? Uh, like about the coming in on time, being prompt, having right. shots. Right. I mean, an appointment. Don't just walk in. Don't be coming and getting in my way. She has the same kennel system as I do. So, it's simple. gorgeous. We don't have a lot of dogs up in here, right? Is it? No, we have a whereby appointment one-on-one, -on -one and that's what it's scheduled. It's just like this. Wow, I'm so that's <laughs> awesome. That's awesome. I'm so glad to meet you. Yeah, it's very pretty in here. Can he walk? Can you walk? Yeah. Can you go ahead. Oh, really? Go, go have fun. We show him these barn doors. That's, this is beautiful. Everybody loves those. I have the barn doors. That's the kitchen over there. It was really nice. It was really nice. Oh, wow. Yeah, I'm looking for a place in so you can Oh, my gosh, guys. Look at her tub. Look at that awesome tub, guys. Yeah, purple. She's a purple fan. I'm going to ask her. What's your favorite color? Uh, purple. Purple. <laughs> it's purple down here and blue upstairs. Blue upstairs. What? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. So it's just a deep for a spoken plus little bit. Oh, it's just a 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 little bit. Guys, it's so pretty in here. I could live here. <laughs> Where did this come out of? Uh, this is so pretty, guys. Butterflies. Didi, look, butterfly. I know. Yeah, and all the pictures are mine. I'm going to try to start selling them. Oh, yeah. You need a frame a little bit. Please, that. Because it'll start well, the hair starts to. Well, I actually don't get a lot of hair out here. Oh, well, that's true. But, uh, you got that for Which is probably why I moved, because the other one was about just this. Yeah. She says she makes all these pictures, guys. They're so beautiful, right? You guys want to purchase a picture or something like that? Hey, no copying. No copyright. Yeah. No copying. Don't, they can't don't, copy that. Yeah, don't copy anything. You guys copy. They, they are copying. I know who's copying. You guys are copying stuff. And I know you're copying stuff. So you do this for upstairs. And what about downstairs? Christina Garcia, I wish, man. I wish we could. Yeah, that purple tub is awesome. Sandra, thanks for the two. Barbie, babe, thanks for the 275 Canadian. Deanne, this is your first time seeing California? This is awesome, right? Look at that bird. <laughs> 
very nice vibe. Yep. If you're interested in coming out, hey, Julie. Do the same thing. Where it's, where it's time for stuff like that. Definitely. And if you live so close, would it be, would you be interested in something like where it's after hours? So I'm going to interfere with your daily business. So well, I if I had two people have a little event, I would work near the month. Right. Because right now I work. Every day is a Sunday. Right. And actually, I was never going to be open Sunday, but she's telling me we're okay. Is this your picture too, right here? That. That's pretty. I like How that. that? <laughs> 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 is this acrylic? Yeah, I'm working on the prices. Oh, yeah. The problem is I don't want to spend the money and not sell them. Yeah. Because it's not cheap to get right. the canvas and all right. that. So you could do the, you could do these at postcard sizes and then offer. Look at the floor, floor, guys. This is awesome. Yeah, so you don't have to do it. Yeah, yeah. And then I do the photo session uh, for the dogs and like an artist choice. Oh, so the jewelry. Yeah. 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 For the group owner, she seems so friendly. Yeah, yeah. she does. We'll probably end it on this one, guys, because it's so friendly. A lot of clients right now, so and they're rotating because people are moving and people are right. Um, dogs have died, people have died, right. so right now it's probably the least busy I've ever been. Really? Melissa P, you're out there. Oh, yeah, Melissa P's been member since, so she's our longest member. Not that, not yet? Yeah. Hey, Melissa P. Right now, after change, it's probably 45. You guys, go ahead, click the join button if you haven't. Smash the like button. Subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet. But the girl that the girl that I, I work with, she has her own. What's up? Road. DT. Uh, the girl that you work with that comes here? No. Girl I'm friends with. Sorry. Okay. She uh she's a little bit more than I am. Okay. But people that we know that like our groomer check supply check, they're like, you need to raise your prices. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. I raise them as they go. Right. You have to. You have to raise your prices as you go. Walmart raises their prices as they go. Every year, I've been told by an accountant that <laughs> Didi, every January, everybody raises their, you get right, your rent goes up, doesn't it? When you go renew your lease, you have to negotiate the same rent. They're not gonna keep it at 1400 for like six years, are they? No, it'll go from 1400 to 1410 to 1425 to 1475 until one year you're at 1500. And then that's how that's how your mortgage works too. If your interest changes or you refinance your loan, it's not gonna be the same thing. So know every side of it. And if you're the consumer, know that you know you're not paying the same price for milk as you did in 1999. So things go up, okay, on both sides. So to have that discussion with somebody, you need to make sure you one, take care of your groomers and tip them if they're doing a great job. And two, you just respect the fact that she's a business. So whatever business that is that we're talking about. So, all right, so uh, thanks for your time. I know you're gonna get to lunch and everything, but uh, can I make sure, get your card and stuff and I'll talk to you more? Okay, come here. Come here. I'll just write down your stuff here. You can just leave our card too. too. So, do me a favor and write down uh, just your like, cell number here. And I'll leave you our card here so you have that. Not yet, that's number three. We'll go there next. Show the bath. Did you guys not see the bathtub? Don't call her and tell her that. <laughs> I don't have I just showed you guys the bathtub. It looks like that's like a bucket of uh, the, the faucet. That's weird. Pretty, right? <laughs> so clean. No, she does it. She has other groomers too. Tell me how to become a member. I think Kelly or someone else has tried to tell me. Okay, Deanne Warner. Um, do you see Nightbot? Nightbot actually posts a link. It says, click here to join. Um, click here to become a member. When Nightbot says that, Nightbot is an automated system that I designed to help you guys with links. So just click on that Nightbot link that says, click here to become a member, and he'll take you to the link and just follow out. I believe it's like $5.30 a month. Thank you so much. Thanks. I appreciate it. Thanks. Thank you. Woohoo. Thanks for opening the door. No problem.
guys. Got that thing that dropped? Yeah. Alright, let's get in the car, let's chit chat. Start this. Woo! We found the one. <laughs> we don't have to search no more. No, we don't. But she said, she said, I do not recommend the last place that you're about to go because she saw my notebook. She said, Did you go there yet? I said, No. She goes, I don't recommend it. That means we gotta go check it up. One more, one last one to go Are you check sure? it up. Why not? You guys want to, you want to check out the third one we had pulled up, or do you guys want to just call it a day? That was actually pretty good, right? That was awesome. I did not expect that. Yes, they want to see the last one. I bet they want to see them all. <laughs> so get ready. We got some stuff coming for you. You're probably 2021. You guys are going to see some really cool shit happen. 2020, we got something really nice planned out for you guys. Go there, please. <laughs> all right, so here's the deal. One. What did she, I wonder if she's going to go pop up right now and check it out on YouTube on her phone. Like, come on. So one, what did she do right? She was locked. It said closed. She opened the door. Okay. Two, she was like, I know you. Are you taking a phone call right now? You weirdo. Uh, she, two, she was like, I know you. And she was, whether, whatever her opinion of, is of me, she opened the door and said, yes, come in. And then um, she led us to her. She said, this is what you want from a groomer. Those of you guys who have said, how do I, how do I you know, find the right groomer? You guys know you guys have asked me this. This is how you find the right groomer. Can if I was home? a pet owner. Hold on, Diddy. Oh, hold on. We had to take a phone call. Okay. <sighs> so, uh, where was I at? You guys have asked me, how do you guys find the right groomer? I'm right now trying to find the right groomer for grooming. You guys would be finding... Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you now. Can you hear me? We had to take a phone call, guys. Okay. You guys are... Some of you guys are trying to find the, gr the groomer for your dog. This is also how you should approach it. I'm going to go, you, you lay out the plan. You should probably visit at least three, right? You call three plumbers, I hope. You call three electricians, I hope. You call three home builders, I hope, when you guys are doing other stuff. Just call three groomers. And sometimes you can call, but for me and what I'm trying to do, calling doesn't really work. I'm coming in here to try to groom out of your facility. I need to see your facility. And I need mm -hmm. to see it on the spot. I... I don't need to hear you on the phone treat me like a piece of shit. I need to freaking show up and show my face and let you know I'm pretty serious about what I'm trying to do. And I'm on YouTube and I'm going to do it live with my fans so we can all decide if this is a place I should actually, you know, do this or not. And you guys can be like, oh, Didi, you saw Didi, get the heck out of there, man. Like, hell no, right? So I need, to, I'm going to work somewhere and I'm going to pay her to let me work there. So this is important to me. So if your dog is going to stay somewhere for six, seven hours a day for a pet groom, it might be important to you to go see what, what the, did you see the pads she had in the kennels? Did you see how beautiful those were? They're like velvet purple pads, man. <laughs> she made them herself. I bet she is an artist. Groomers are freaking artists, man. Uh, my groomer told me not to bring my dog back, but my boy back as he cried. What? A groomer here told me not to bring my boy back as he cried. Okay, I don't I don't know why he was crying. All right, so we're going to go to the next facility. I'm really happy here. I I don't mind stopping. You know how you you know how you're doing research and you're like, "This is the one." But, you know what? We've got you guys. We had you guys give us your opinion and we're going to go ahead and check out this last one. She's leaving there. Bye. Um you know what she said to me on the way out? She said, "Didi, basically my cost is your casa." She said, whatever you want to do here, just let me know. That's exactly what she said. And I am just like floored. Her, her uh, hospitality, her, she was a great host. She was sweet. She was kind. Um, she was a giver. She's very clean. She doesn't have like 25 cages up in there, smelly and all this stuff. I mean, it was just amazing. So amazing. she has, 
She just moved into this facility into a same kind of lease with the same owner. She was just down here, she said. And this facility actually allows her an upstairs downstairs scenario, so which is great. Um, a lot of places don't offer that, and I really think that that's a pretty cool thing. Um, she said she's been having a lot of transition and clients, pet passing away, humans passing away, military moving in and out of the area. So she's had a very uh, a, hit, a low point on the amount of clientele. She's like, this is uh, as low as uh, as slow as it's been. Um, she has a groomer that comes and helps her and works only on Saturday and Sunday. So otherwise, she would have a, a day off. It doesn't sound like she has a day off was at this she, time. Was she a groomer also? Her? Yeah. She's the owner and groomer. Okay. She's the owner and the only groomer. And then she has another lady that is only able to do Saturday and Sunday grooming until she gets a nanny or a babysitter, she called. Mm. So this last place we're going to go, it's been at least 50 minutes, hasn't it? Mm -hmm. 51 I mean, minutes. You guys have any donations? You guys can support our channel as we do this Donate live for you. Donate to support the stream as there's... It's, um, that would really help? Yeah. Okay, so we're going to go to this one. Oh, it's only five minutes, so... Let me see here. Donate to support the stream, guys. I, we could take, like, maybe avoids tolls. Okay, this is yeah, going to take no me tollies, on the highway bro. a little bit. No, no, no. I, I don't know if it's going to... I don't know. I'm not sure. Wow, I just don't want to leave, man. I love that I place, man. I loved it, too. I would live here. I mean, this she, is nice. And she was so nice, like... Did you and her artwork? I was like fifty bucks. I was ready to buy that, and I and I, I really probably will come back and pick up one of her pictures, uh, especially the acrylic. It's so pretty. Linda, hey, Linda okay. Heath, thanks for Let the ten. Let me take a sip of coffee here. I have to go back to work. See you later, Jennifer Torres. Thanks for coming out, Jennifer. All right, let me go right here. Thanks for the ten, you guys. You guys know that donations Thank is what for, keeps us going. Yep, exactly. And Without you guys' support, we would not be here. We would not be here doing this right exactly, now without Barbie, you guys. Every, I'm really happy you're here. Thank you. Every little bit helps. Is Everyone it, just donate a dollar right now. Just go. Everyone pitch in a dollar for time, for what, intruding on the... For intruding on this. Having the courage to walk up into a groom shop, even though they don't... I know they don't want me to walk up in there. But if... Look at... Look at oh, Filipino food! Oh, uh, are you kidding me, dude? Uh, uh, You're crazy. Do you guys want to eat some Filipino food with us? Where are you going? You're going to run in there and get some... Uh, Look how <laughs> packed that thing looks, man. There's, I guy, have, there's, there's guys no outside Filipino the door. restaurants in Texas, man. It says, now hiring. Those people that don't have a job, you act like sitting at home doing nothing. I know somebody right now I'm trying to talk about Work, in Texas. Working our unemployment rights? Come on. Go yeah. get a dang job. You want job. to talk about unemployment? Get your ass up and go get a job. Okay, I'm done with that one. Now let's go. Go get me some uh, lumpia, pancit, uh, what else? Kawali. Get me a chicken get a sisig Okay, okay. All right, we'll come back. But I need a, oh, it's right here. Oh my gosh, I could totally be grooming right there and totally freaking eat Filipino lumpia. every day. No, you oh. like you got to reverse. <laughs> now I got to reverse. Oh, this the is, guy behind me got to reverse too. We're both doing over here like. This is a tough spot. Well, because the semi truck's all up in here. Donna Kurtz, thanks. Welcome to becoming a new member. Be sure to use your emojis that you can use. And thank you for the member. Woohoo! You are supporting my favorite groomer and YouTube for that. Wonderful. As, you, as YouTube um, works on upgrading stuff, we will be more, a little more more active on the community posts. So be sure to go check out the community post. We're gonna be working Where on that. Where do you check out community posts? I'm not sure. It's fairly new. Dang man, I'm so in love with that spot. Kaylin Ricker, thanks for the 199. Melissa P, thanks for the 10. Little did she know she just became an Airbnb for me because I'm about to talk to her about some numbers. <laughs> Man, that's a beautiful new building. You... She opened the door, you guys. That's the first Ohana Hawaiian barbecue. Ooh, oh my gosh. This is bro. my home right here, bro. I feel at home already. This is it. Dreamweaver, thanks for the 199. Yes, we love it. 199. Woohoo! Two bucks. Just a dollar, man. Get 99 Blunt, cents. Thanks for the two bucks. Woohoo! Pow wow up here. Woo -hoo -hoo. Okay. So I'm gonna go straight. Is this my turn, man? These roads are hard to read on the map, man. One road, one way in, and four C8. ways out. Okay. Did you guys catch the name of her business? So if you live in California, I would totally 
use her as a groomer. The next step would be, I love the facility, I love the attitude, I love the cleanliness, I love the attention to detail, I love the art, I love like my artist she is, you know, the color she used, and then now I'm gonna try you as a groomer. So that, that would be your next step, is to try her as a groomer. Yep. She does one, she does appointment grooming. She requires rabies and DHPP is what I saw. And just for the sake of just grooming, I would recommend you get Bordetella as well. I'm not your veterinarian. Please consult your veterinarian if you kind of doubt what I'm saying is my advice, but that's my opinion. So make sure you consult with the veterinarian if you have questions. Don't consult Dee Dee the pet groomer. Robin Wiley, thanks for the 199. Woohoo! Woohoo! Woo what are they saying with it? Because you, you gotta read this. I can't read, man, and drive at the same time. Robin Wiley said, love watching y'all. Grace Blunt said, they should be honored to have you walk in there. Thanks, that's sweet. Kaylin Ricker said, thanks. Melissa P did a sticker. Cool, woohoo! And Barbie said, every little bit helps. Every little bit does help. Can't do it alone, you guys. Can't do it alone. I cannot face life alone. I'm glad you guys are here. And those of you guys haters on the stream, be sure to make a like or dislike on the feed. That always helps too. And thanks for being here, having a an addiction to our channel. We couldn't do it without you. Everything that you watch helps the ratings of the show. Check out that car over there, guys. It has no hood. <laughs> talk about you'll never have engine that is not allowed in texas engine heated problems oh, look at this girl's tats man oh she got a hawaiian thing is she smoking a cigar that's a hawaiian warrior head on her Ooh. Hawaiian. <laughs> i'm in right here i guess i'm in mini california hawaii right here bro yeah right yeah does she have oh, oh she has hawaii say, stuff on her mini hawaii Betty, are you out there? Sheila, are you out there? My Myra Lynch, thanks for the um, 1.0 euro dollars. Cool. I don't know how that guy could be driving around with no hood. I don't know that either, man. We would not let, they would get, that would not be allowed. You'd get pulled over once you go across the block. Uh, maybe the license plate was like a... Ooh, Damn. She wanna go room room. I should have done some room room. I should have done some room room on her. We're in a red car. Did you guys see what car we're in? Oh my goodness. Come man. to Newfoundland. We just approved to open our salon full time in our home. What? I should have anybody that wants me to visit their salon to write me. You guys have to write me your name, your address, and everything. It, and then, oh wait, I'm gonna do something. You have to write me an essay about why you think I should come to your salon. I think that would be cool, right? Something like that. You have to write me a letter. It has to have your address, your phone number, an email, and an essay about why I should come visit your salon. And then I read it all out loud and then YouTube votes where I go. I think that's what I should do. Oh yeah. That would be hella cool. And I just totally missed my term. Daggummit. Daggummit. Guess we're gonna take the long way around. Leanne Conley, thanks for the two. Hey, Dee Dee and David, new subscriber from the UK. Woohoo, thank you. Awesome, UK is awesome. I think UK also pops with uh, YouTube. A lot of UK people do YouTube too. Is, it, is this a one-way hole on here? No, the yellow means opposite okay. intersection. It did look like a one-way, right? If you glance? Yeah. Kind of looked like... But you always tell by the, by the, the, the center lane. Yeah, but it's still, man, it just looked like... Is this it? Justice. Might be at home. No, we have to go. Oh, are, we're almost there? No, 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 no. No, I don't think it looks like it's gonna be. At my favorite groomer, and you should charge for it, lady. Get your flights paid. <laughs> yeah, something like that. We have to look at everything. You know Perla's I mean? like, can I do an essay about why you should come to Kentucky? Yes, please, please, <laughs> please. Everyone's invited to do an essay. You know, that's like. Um, I wonder if the first groomer knew who you were, they Arturo said. You never know. You know that people don't like me, right? Oh, she might have been one of those haters. Oh, is this a one way? Yes. No parking between the street. No, because those signs wouldn't be the facing so this way. So confusing, bro. Yeah, there's no center lane this one. 
Just look for the yellow in the middle. Okay, there's no yellow. <laughs> Bro, I'm not a freaking traffic advisor, okay, so don't you so, you're sure hold me like to me it. Just a moment ago. Yeah, because I know that. I know the yellow is, separates look at the intersections. Palm trees. palm trees. Those, those. That one needs some help. Someone needs to climb Ooh, that boy. What's he doing? <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> what the frick? <laughs> oh, he oh. Oh. oh my god <laughs> what the you guys if we if we drive around recording man look at all these people we freaking catch doing <laughs> doing something wrong <laughs> that guy with the bicycle that man. day set the rob but doing something we weird totally asked him what he's doing oh what's this jamaican store oh yeah this is jamaican food every little thing jamaican what i've Ooh, never eaten jamaican food over there I've never eaten I'm Jamaican go right. food. I'm gonna go around and look at this. What's this other thing over here? This supermarket. Thanks for the donation, Thanks. guys. If you haven't donated to support the stream, donate to support the stream. If you haven't hit the like button, hit the like button. If you haven't subscribed, subscribe. Lime Life, Lime Leaf Thai Lao Kitchen, Three J's Asian Market, Asian Market, True Symmetry Brewing. What kind of brewing? What is that plant? Is that beer? doesn't look like a corn, does it? Well, brewing men's beer, I think. Well, they brew marijuana here, don't they? <laughs> it's just not brewing. Oh, here's a hair and nail salon. I want to get my toenails done. I can't go to that event with my nails all Up looking jacked. Up blue eyelashes. Healthy living. Sewing. Excuse me. Bait and tackle, okay. Bait and tackle, what does that look like? Liquor Mart. What does that sound like, bait and tackle? Blue Devils, what? Loingo. Ling bingo. Is that bingo? Oh, yeah, bingo. 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 All right, let's go to the pet groomer. Oh, what's this guy with the boat doing? Oh, he's going to the tackle place. Oh, yeah. Where are they going fishing at? Oh, that's what it means, bait. I was thinking of, like... Police officer oh baiting God. somebody and tackling <laughs> oh, them. OMG, man. Like, do they teach you to bait somebody and tackle them? <laughs> okay, I went out too far. I gotta go around again. What's that guy doing right there, Gosh, man? He ditches for water, man. Is that a restaurant or something? That's her husband, man. Oh. That's a big he palm heard tree. Me talking. Yeah, you did. Oh, man. Mobile man. home community, guys. I had a YouTube. Do a live Ooh, bingo game. Oh, look at that game. tree! Oh my gosh, those are some nice trees. Look at that big. Is that a palm tree that's overgrown? It's different family. What? There's the different family huge. palm trees. Those are almost dinosaurs. Palm trees look like dinosaurs, guys. They oh, come from back sign? then. Uh, yeah. Oh, he, got... he got a scooter. That's why, that's why the palm trees are so tall, guys. That's what I think. Because they used to be around when dinosaurs were around. So the dinosaurs would use them. Gosh dang it. I have to design these phone holders. Just, they don't know what they're doing. Okay. Oh, Perla knew it was for fishing. We're all being <laughs> idiots over here. You, not me. I knew what it was for. <laughs> that's what I was thinking, though. Okay. Here we are. Be ready. Oh, man, I already don't like it. Pet grooming. Pa spa. No public restrooms. Oh, I already sign. don't like it, man. What don't you like? We haven't even walked in. Okay. I'm already right. nervous All we because can do is get in I'm there. already nervous because of what that lady said. <laughs> get out! Well that's why you can't make a prejudgment. That's why we're here on our own to walk in and just see for our own selves. All right, um, <sighs> all right, let's go. Let's do this. Let's do this, guys. Where she looks, guys. Thanks for the luck. Can you guys smell? Okay, guys, here we go. Tuesday through Saturday. 
Look at the dust and everything here, man. Look at that. Look at all that. Yeah. This must be broke. I do kind of like that aspect, though. Neon lights. Are you ready? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. You gotta see your own thing. Look at all that. Look at all that. Okay. with my favorite groomer on YouTube. Is the uh, owner here? Uh, no, the owner's out right now. Can I take a message? Yeah, I'll leave my car. We were just trying to, I'm actually here uh, in California about once a month and we're on our live channel right now. We're interviewing groomers to see if I can uh, find a place to groom out of while I'm here every month. And so if you want to have her give me a call, that'd be great. Okay. Oh, awesome. Can I, uh, I'm recording. May I bring my camera? Can I ask to be on it? No, we can look down at the floor. Okay, look at the floor. Sweet. All right, let's do this. I hate my picture. <laughs> <laughs> no problem. Oh, that's okay. Me out. <laughs> hey, what's up? I'm Dee Dee. You're a groomer that works here? Hi. Yeah. I won't, I won't interrupt you too long because I'm a groomer and I know when someone walks in, I'm like, get out. This but, dog uh, won't care. I can talk and work at the same, same time. time. Are you Dee Matt in there? Yeah. Oh, my goodness, man. Hey, buddy. He comes every <laughs> couple of weeks. He comes every couple of weeks? Yeah. Is that the tail or the leg there? This is his tail. His tail is matted, man. No, it's just... Mm, exactly. When they wash him at home, they do the... Yeah. <laughs> Don't do that, right? Yeah. It brushes out really easily because he comes all the time, so... Cool. So what do you... This is neat. I'm, I'm, you got a lot of space up in here. Yeah. Can I look? Yeah, you can uh, oh, sure. help yourself to the nickel. Cool. Table. Wow, that's an old school table right there. That's like plastic, right? With the Edemco dryer one. Cool. You mean purple table? Yeah, what is that? It's a table that that company designed it specifically for. What hey, buddy. For what? Oh, that's perfect. You okay? So it doesn't dry off the, the wood that we have on the table. It's our primary table back here. It used to have a little bit of a, a V to the middle. Uh -huh. The water would drain off. Wow. Because then we put the towel on the back. Right. Or your feet will be soaked, right? <laughs> wow. Um, but yeah, so yeah, we've got it's a pretty good size. Pretty, this is a pretty big building, too, girl. Yeah, it's 1200 oh, square feet. Okay. 1200 square feet this is huge, man. Yeah. You could do pet sitting out of this. You could do pet sitting out of this mug. She's interested in um, what I'm trying to do is find a place I can groom out of when I come out here about twice a, tw uh, twice a month, once a month. So once a month I'm in California. I'm based out of Texas. We do a lot of grooming on YouTube. Everything I do is usually recorded. Um, I have my own, you know, business entity and things that we can talk about off camera that would protect me. So I'm interested in finding a place to groom out of because the clients that I'm call getting calls from in California, I have no place to groom. So if uh, the owner's interested in something where it's, uh, we talk about numbers and things like that, and, uh, you know, that I'm just, I would have my own equipment, and, except, or oh, I would probably use your <laughs> table, your, uh, your, um, I could probably still get my own table and stuff here, but your tub, I wouldn't want to be traveling with a tub. So, uh, no, well, I got two back there. Yeah, so you know what I mean? Got a table that's just collecting Absolutely. junk. Cool. So, uh, um, don't all do... tables collect junk when they're not in use? Right, right. Exactly. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, that's electrical too, table, too. Yeah. So that's what kind of what we're doing. I've uh, visited a few groomers already. I'm still just, you know, wrapping it up. I want, to, I want to visit about 10 groomers and see what I feel comfortable with. You know, you're mm -hmm. going to work there. And I don't mind uh, if it's after hours because I'm not trying to interfere in your business at all. You know what I mean? And the type of dogs I groom are aggressive, senior, and disabled is most, place, most cases. Uh, so I don't mind being like an after hour thing. So so it's just, just a one at a time. You know what I mean? So we could talk yeah. about it. We, yeah. We do some aggressive, we do seniors, right. um, we do, yeah, 
I don't have too many that are disabled anymore. Right. Um, I don't think I do have any. Do you Mainly have they're just lazy. Right. I just put their butt right. in the sling and hang them up and say, too bad we're doing it anyway. Right. Well, I invented this product. I don't know if you heard of it. I don't even have the cards because this wasn't my intent. Uh, it's called the Dog Up Stand. You can look it up on the internet. Uh, it's called dogupstand.com, and it helps assist a dog to stand mm -hmm. up while you're grooming. Is that the one that looks like kind of a giant pillow with a... Nope, no. not at all. Okay. Um, it's a bone, dog bone. It one, well, we have three three versions. We have a small mini, which is like a dog bone shape. It's okay. really handy. If it falls on the floor, you feel a little bit more like, I could throw this thing around. Um, <laughs> and then we have an aluminum version in the small size, which is perfect for these guys right here that okay. want to sit a lot. It saved me 17 minutes off of a Shih Tzu grooming. Just Here, show her the logo so she knows when oh, yeah, she looks yeah. it up. So when this you one. look it up, you want to look for the Dog Up Stand logo. Oh, okay. And just go watch a video if you have YouTube, uh, Dog Up Stand. And okay. you'll you'll see, like, right now, I, you wouldn't have to hold him up. You could just work. Oh, he'll, just, he'll stand. He'll just I just stand. have it there so that I can... No, no, but in general, because you said, you know, you, you have lazy dogs, so yeah, I get that. But this one, he comes He looks enough. great. He's yeah, doing he, great. He He's comes off enough, that. he knows the drill. Right. Right. You know, and I just, because I don't want to brush something that he won't like, so I right. just put my hand under Absolutely. there. Absolutely. Yeah. You know, but, yeah, no, this dog He looks like a dog that you do do. I know. Exactly. I'm does. trying to think about it. Yeah, he comes Did you get a glance at the dog? Yeah. Now that her back's to you, you could probably get a glance. He's pretty cute. Well, thank you for your time. I appreciate yeah, you. Sure. I left my number thank on you. there, so give me okay. a call, okay? All right. I'll have her call you. Um, should be within the next couple of days. Okay. So, cool. Um, she also, she manages a grooming school also. So. Oh, oh, really? Which, which, what is, which grooming school does she manage? It's called Golden Shears in Golden. San Jose. San Jose? Okay, write this down. I'll look it up. Yeah. Golden Shears. Um, 11149 Clayton Road, San Jose. All right, girl. Thank you so much. Yeah, I appreciate you. Thanks for, you might give her a call. You might be able to go down there. Yeah. Or something. Or really? Okay, cool. Okay, cool. Card now. What was your name? Robin. Thanks, Robin. Thanks, you. bye. 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 Very nice though. She was very nice. In my in my head the whole time I was like, she's the owner. She's the owner. She's the owner. At the end it's like, no, she's not. She's very nice though. She was very she was nice. She was really nice. I can't believe YouTube is still here with me. What happened? What were you guys? Okay, okay, hold on, hold on. Let me, hold on, let let's, me, let's let me turn just... on the car and go park over there for a minute. It's really, really uh, sunny right here. So go let's... shower, they said. How do you know? Well, how do they know? Could you? Okay, hold on, hold on. I need to regroup my thoughts. There's only so much opinion opinionating I can do. Um, I really without... like how nice she was, though. Like, because I would, I would assume that if she's nice, the owner's gonna be nice too. It's just no, you can't assume that. Yeah, but can't assume that. Can you assume that, you guys? You can't assume that. There's no, there's no tree coverage here. There's you no gotta shade. scroll up to the comments and they're and a bunch of laughing. I need to get face. run, Diddy, run fast. Are you serious? Yeah. <laughs> the one thing I cannot share with you right now is the smell. I cannot tell you how the smell went. Um, you guys can wrap it around your own mind, but I think what I could smell was, uh, it's a very old building. There is no uh, dust, regular, you know, dusting, you know what I mean? There's uh, no regular dusting, outdoor cleansing of the bugs and uh, the lighting, little things that I, I don't take for granted a little bit of the lighting and I'm not a hundred percent the perfect person in cleaning but I'm, pr I'm pretty clean I like to say I'm a little bit cleaner than the average person but what I mean is like I wouldn't touch anything that any of the product there because it had so much dust build up so uh, by the way this is how you go through a ditch so you don't scrape you go sideways so in my okay here I'll pull up right here um We'll do a little chit chat here and then we gotta, we're gonna gotta peel off and then we might come back later. I'll let you guys, we'll see. Um, how's our heat? How is our uh, battery life? I can't tell them battery life, where's the battery? I can't tell, I don't know what the heck. It's a new phone, it's just, you're gonna lose stuff. That, uh. Oh. Stop.
How do I get back? Well, stop. Okay, go. Put it, put it regular. Here, it's gonna be over here. Oh, you guys have no idea talking. Just what? Why is it so zoomed up now? <sighs> Could you guys see all that? He's swiping, hitting things, bumping things. He's gonna just totally get you guys disconnected. Okay, let me think. Without, in my opinion. Um, it really needs an overhaul of cleaning. I, I would not want to work inside there because of the smell. Um, it would really, really bother me. Um, they had some seriously old equipment I've never seen in my career, which I can't, that table was pretty cool, but did you guys see the purple rubber table, whatever? She said it was designed for, that's smart. It's designed to like blow dry the dog on the table so it could get wet and not damaged you know now nowadays the tables are pretty cheap and that's particle usually particle board in between the rubber and then if you have a crack of some sort and water gets in there it eventually erodes the table i get that and um and so when she said i'm not the owner and in my head i was like this you're, there's only one grooming table in here <laughs> there's only one grooming table being used right and i'm like eh. anyway she may not be the owner but she's probably the only groomer that works in there and um, she had a dog in the back, a dog in the front, a dog on the table, or two dogs in the front cage. Did you see how many cages were there? So <laughs> Those some, were all kennels, not cages. Kennels. Um, I have been in places where they have that many kennels and they were all full. And it was loud and there was only two people there and it was just crazy. Uh, so that was nothing to me, but that was a lot of kennels in the back and the front. A lot like that i imagine you know there was a time where it was that busy it, you would not have all those kennels if it wasn't that busy so they they were really busy at some point and i guess she, the owner of that place is also a lillian ward thanks for the 20 you guys don't forget to lillian, donate. thank you for the donation we're almost about to wrap it up if you want to support what we've done today uh please donate that helps us do other things like this. Um, it's not cheap. It's not free. Nothing's cheap. Nothing. Nothing's f not cheap, but nothing's free. Um, someone pays for it in some way, shape, or form. So we are out here and we're giving you our free time. And so you're, you contributing to the channel is like, you know, helpful. So uh, I do want to read what you guys have written here. That place is... Yeah, I'm gonna go go, let's go back up to when we kind of started uh, walking in. And... It's not as bad as David anticipated, so I told him, you know, don't prejudge it. You never know. Here you go. Okay. It's after the Clippers emoji. Okay. Definitely an OP. Bad vibe. No, needs rehab badly. So dirty, gross. So No, thank you. Is it safe for them to be stacked? I don't like the stacking myself, Kaylin. Oh, my God, get that dog out. <laughs> Hell no. Wow. So how many of you guys commenting are groomers? And I'll catch up to your answer. Are you groomers or pet owners? Looks like she needs more personnel. Back out now. I agree, Kaylin. Oh, hells nah. <laughs> the Best Life TV, what's up? Um, it looks like an animal rescue center. I don't like it, Donna says. Mold, did you guys see mold? Oh my God. I kept, yeah, I kept like, David, like, get that, get that. Yeah, it's gonna look like slime. Like, like. A lot run down. Run, David, run. Dee Dee, run while you still can. Oh, my goodness, you guys. Oh, my God, that's disgusting. Get out before you take fleas with you. Oh, yeah. Oh. Shit, I need to check my shit. Oh, my God, nope. Wonder what health department would say. PMSL, Donna. Run, run fast. Dave, save yourself. You guys are really, really not liking that place. Oh, no, Diane says. They need some help cleaning that place up. Okay, can you imagine going in as a team cleaning some place that hasn't been cleaned in 10 years? Can you imagine the buildup? Um, I can't tell you, but I worked at a veterinarian clinic that I spent eight hours cleaning before I accepted the job and I got no pay for it. Mm -hmm. Oh my God, you're going to take fleas home and some sort of disease from that mess. Why so many kennels? They have so many kennels because they were that busy at one time. At one time, yeah. Spent your grooming time making sure no dogs leave with anything you'll catch something for sure isn't your phone ringing david for an important call <laughs> oh wow dd and david run 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 the last place was the best hundred percent green mold i think is toxic anyone else heard this i can't believe dd is being so chill with her <laughs> who said that angie 
place needs complete overhaul. Floor is bad, walls, electrical, and waiting area. I don't think she get that many dogs, especially since there are other groomers in the area. Not happy with that amount of kennels. Me either. You read my mind. Small ones at that. Only one biggish Maybe crate. Those that are the good kennels, though. The one we have for our doggies. The, I know. So that let me tell you, they don't make those kennels anymore. Yeah. So the, we have, I, I bought kennels for Suey and Duke because they had to travel on an airplane from Germany. So I had to buy kennels that were rated at the time, which is in the year 2000, maybe 1999. I got some kennels for them and they had to be really hard, tough stuff. And they are, they're really good kennels. They don't make them like that anymore. So if those are the types of kennels that they, they have, then I know that they've had those about 19 years, right? Right. The average, right. Yep. Is what I can assume because I have them. Uh, they're really good. They don't make them like that anymore. This That place is horrible. Hope you may have flea spray in your car. Yuck. Run and save yourself. No, no, no. That toy looked like dirty. Use hand sanitizer. <laughs> Go shower. Nice doesn't mean clean. No, it doesn't. Mold. Laugh out loud. Wow. Bad. Best life TV still. <laughs> he used a brown thumb too. Did you Take a shower. Enjoy that? Did you guys enjoy it though? That tub was disgusting. It was. Go back and watch it. I will later. We might have to do a separate video, you guys, that I'm going to do some editing. You got to scroll up cool. the, all the comments. I know I just did. Run, DD, run fast. So crazy. Nice Niceness doesn't matter. It's the safety of animals. Nice doesn't give a good rep for DD's clean grooming or flea policy. She was nice. Just the place needs cleaning. Mold. Well, it looked moldy and nasty, so I bet there was a smell. There was a smell. It was... Mm -hmm. Where's my doTERRA oils now? I will get them out. The dust at the end, David, was so funny. Did you catch your dust on the way out? Oh, uh, there was something laying there, and I went like this, too, so I can see the oh, dust. Oh, and you touched it, and you didn't tell me? Don't touch me. Ew. Ew. <laughs> there was visible water damage. Safety of animals. Had to step away. Sorry. You had to step away. I was in there, Kaylin. See, told you, a complete overhaul down to studs. I have to give you credit. You don't judge people. You are awesome. Yeah, I try not to judge. You don't know what's going on. Don't judge. Just face value. I, I should be able to say I don't like it. I should be able to say that's too many kennels in my opinion. Okay, so this here is on guard. I sell it on my website. I'm going to ro roll some on myself here. It's, it's proven, go read, go read about it. It's proven to do some stuff for it, for you. <sighs> I wonder what happens if you put this on a flea. I don't know, we should try it out. Yeah, we should. Okay. Um, ironically, my favorite groomer in Rancho Kakumanga would be an amazing place to work out of once a month. I don't know what part of Cali you guys are looking to work out of though. Um, right now we're in the San Francisco, like north of San Francisco area. No. Oh, yeah. Angie, I can't go take dogs. That's not allowed. As old as those trees you saw. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> David, <laughs> thank you for giving us a tour of the place. That's a good one. Lillian, thank you so much for your donation. The tub's walls were nasty. I don't want to know. I didn't see it. You didn't see it? No, I was too busy kind of. I don't know what I was doing, yeah. but I was scanning everything. You know, scan you can't take it all in. It's just... I'm thinking, scanning, smelling, talking, trying to figure out what I'm going to say. I'll tell you what, guys. All these groomers that we went to that led us to the back, they all have one thing. You guys want to know? That one thing is they have a washer and dryer. Didi needs, <laughs> Didi needs a up. washer and dryer in her facility. Did she have a washer and dryer? No, she the didn't. The person, too. Lillian, thank you for the 50. Wow. Thank you so much. I can't unsee the green slime on the tub. No way. It's that bad. Oh my gosh. I cannot wait to go back and watch this. Go back to the last one. You will help her drum up her business. I know I will. I'm going to incorporate that in the negotiation. <laughs> I missed you. We'll have to go back and watch. Uh, Sue, what's up? Yay, Lillian Ward. Or oh, yeah, Lillian Ward, pet owner. Pet okay, so pet owner, groomer, pet owner, groomer, pet owner, pet owner, pet owner, pet owner. So you guys that are pet owners, I'm telling you. As soon as you walk in, you should know. And then some of the people that tell me about their negative experiences at groomers, they, they left their dogs at, I ask them, did you still leave your dog there? They don't go back there. Groomers don't go back there. No, but I could I'm tell as soon as I walked in, I could smell. As soon as I walked in, I could smell you guys. And as soon as I looked to the left, I, um, 
I saw the amount of kennels and I thought, no thanks. You know, that's not what I'm looking for. And even though there wasn't 35 dogs in there, there could be, you know, and that's what would happen. And it can be a different type of groomer where it's like every morning drop off your pet that needs to be groomed and then at afternoon you pick them up after work. That's That could be a type of groomer they are. So we just don't know, guys. We can't judge like that. Layla says, oh my God, you're so funny. My coffee came out of my nose. <laughs> oh. Oh Beautiful people and so professional. Lillian, thank you for your donation. Amotu Canal. What's that? Amotu Canal. I love your channel. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Arigato. I mean. <laughs> Arigato gozaimasu. Uh, gracias. Thank you. Gracias. <laughs> was the funniest video. Was it? This really is such a fun stream. Uh, oh. Did you guys, like, re really, if you enjoyed it, drop a thumbs up right now. Right now. Thr what like what the emoji? A thumbs up emoji or just just put liked. If you guys enjoyed it. Uh, does nothing on the fleas, David. The on guard. Oh, she's tried it. I, I, you I tried. One step ahead of us. <laughs> on guard, spray it now. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. Oh, too far, but really like the video. Thanks. Do a live as you're watching the video back. Okay. Oh, you guys we'll, want do, that? we'll do that. We'll do a replay and we'll go back and go, oh my gosh, remember that? You know, um, David zoomed in on the slime. Ooh. <laughs> Did you? I should have touched it to see if it oh! comes out. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. Ooh. Why would you picture that? Oh. I'm glad he didn't because he'd be sitting here. I forgot to tell you, Didi, I touched oh the slime. My God. Oh. <laughs> Is it common to sit while grooming? Who? Uh, yeah, for. I'm gonna view. Oh, the to. groomer was sitting down, and I had I had a manager at PetSmart, the one that took on dog after dog after dog until like you had one person had 25 dogs to groom by themselves in an eight-hour shift, which is impossible. <sighs> to bathe and groom and do all this by yourself, 25 dogs, one person. She just kept taking dogs and dogs. She sat, she, as a groomer, she sat as well. And I wanna say it was because of her age. And that groomer had all white hair and missing teeth. And this was my manager at the time. So I'm t trying to paint a picture of how old she was. Glasses, when she she had her glasses, she would put them on and read something and it put them the off. time frame, like 80, 90? I don't really know because 70. I was younger. So I want to say, I would say she was like 70 years old already. Mm -hmm. So I don't know how old this lady is, but the older you get and the longer you've been doing this, your back is going to be affected, okay? And so I can imagine like she was sitting down the whole time. But I want to say that you cannot be a speedy groomer if you sit down, in my opinion. You are not able to do a lot of stuff like I can do, move around the table and stuff, right? You're, you're just going to be sitting there and doing what you got to do and it's going to take a little bit longer. Guys, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe, share it, and donate a couple bucks if you can. Helps the stream out. Front loaders, Donna. Is it common? Yeah. Okay. The green slime was disgusting. I can't believe that she was okay with you going back there. She gave us permission. That's all I got to say. We asked for permission. She said, okay. I'm going to leave it at that. Didi, you should do a commentary video on watching this video. I will. Uh, once we get back like to a computer. A thumbs up. They really like it. A lot of it. thumbs up. Um, they liked the video, Didi. Thank you. I'm glad you liked it all. David, you are so stinking cute, but look like your eyes are burning. <laughs> are they? Why are my eyes burning? I was just curious because I feel like it would I would slow you down. I was just curious because I feel like it would slow you down. Hi from Manaus, Amazon, Brazil. What's up, Amazon, Brazil? I think it's the lighting that makes our eyes look like that. Greetings to all. What, what vaccinations do you require for when you come to the UK? For when you come to the UK? Oh, mm -hmm. for us humans? I gotta look that up. Her legs had a lot of swelling. I think she had to sit. I dog, saw that too. Did you see that? that about 68 and can't sit grooming. <sighs> um, after this video, you guys will probably do what I'm gonna do, which is like, you gotta sit, think, repeat things in your mind and literally take it all in and go, hmm, you know, like, uh, one thing she did say right away was, you have to have a license to board to do any pet sitting, which would be boarding, not pet sitting here in California, because then that would be overnight stay. 
And uh, you also heard her say, I hardly get time off now. I would not want to do that because then I would be up here um, all the time, 24 hours a day, letting the dogs out, cleaning the kennels, which is true, which makes me believe like she is running that place all by herself. Mm -hmm. Okay. And the owner, which is in maybe, uh, how far away is San Jose? Not too far. Yeah, 40 Hercules. minutes. It's about 40, 45 minutes. Yeah. So I don't think the other lady is going to be up here every day. I don't think that's happening. So it does make me think about my own life and making oh, sure. San Jose, look, it's over there an hour and a half. Oh, it's an She's hour and a half. Definitely not here. She's not day. here every day. San Jose is far. She did say, contact her. You might be able to go down there and check her out. We don't have the time this trip to do that, but. You guys can make your own, um, you know, assumptions about everything. Uh, we went in there trying to look for a place to groom out of. Uh, I personally don't feel like I could do that there. One out of three, guys. Which one would you guys pick? We, yep. Which one would you guys pick? We already know the answer Which to one that. would you guys pick? One out of three. The first one, the second one, or third one? Everybody write the comments down below. Go with the second place. David needs fluids. He all out. Oh, you're talking about because I finished my So this is, this is what we're going to do. I'm not going to go back and watch this video until I actually can go back and watch it with all of you guys. So you guys need to make sure you don't miss it. Um, it will be... I, w I really want to go back and watch it, but I won't. I won't let you guys down. I will wait for us to go back together and watch it all together. Because I was over here. You should have saw me. I was like tapping David like, get over there. Go get... Get that. We got permission. Go get it, man. Uh, what I what I, what stuns me is the amount of cages. That's what gets me. Is like we, we wow. It's like and then, we go to the back, and then she's like, go ahead, go back there. <laughs> I was like, go <laughs> and go. <laughs> and then uh, oh oh. All I see in my head is cages, cages and cages and some equipment that, forgive me for saying this out loud, but it looked like a dang electric chair. Hey, but but if that equipment's still working, man, that's, you you buy equipment that was made in the 80s and 90s, that stuff's Remember still, I told you, you spend the money, working. it will it will last a but, lifetime. But, but still, if you buy equipment nowadays like that, that was made in 2014, that equipment's only gonna last you like five months. When you buy equipment that was made in the 90s, it lasts you a lifetime. Why We're, is that? Because nowadays they're making a crap fast, equipment. fast. Because why we want it fast. I get people that order stuff. When is it gonna be here? It's like, hold on, that's man. That's also a vehicle. That's how vehicles work, too. You go buy a new car, it only lasts as much miles. You go buy an old car that's like made in the 50s, it's gonna la last you a lifetime as long as you keep fixing it. I don't know, man. That's okay, true. you guys learned some stuff, right? I know I did. I always learn stuff. But I'm going to tell you right now, you don't know what's going on. Wherever you're taking your dog, go ask if you can get a tour. If you can't get a tour, that's a wake-up call. The next thing is always be aware of your surroundings. You walk in, you don't like something, just say no. Um, or ask them to change it. Hey, by the way, it's really, really dirty in here. I don't feel comfortable, so we're going to leave. But if ever changed, I'd be happy to come back. You're a really nice person. Boom. Uh, mm -hmm. it, in facts is very educational and it gives somebody opportunity to change or to do something about it and sometimes it's not their fault uh sometimes a lot of times it's not the, all the time right it's not the dog's fault it's the human involved so we look at the human and go can you fix this can you stop can you change can you do these things and sometimes we look at a matted dog and go did you not know that what do do what your, her hands did like with the no what did she say? She the she goes. The owners bathe the dog, and this is what they do to the tail. Put your hands together. Yeah, don't dry your don't bathe your dog and do that. You have to scrunch the hair and the soap. Don't tease the hair with your fingertips. So she probably has never told the client, "Hey, is this how you're doing it?" Or "Hey, if there's a knot, don't bathe the dog. Brush it out first." Because then she's sitting there dematting the the tail. But really, it comes down to you communication, right? And we're all afraid to communicate because we don't want to hurt people's feelings and we don't want to stop it Get over it. It's just a fact The fact is the dog's tails matted and we're trying to figure out why and we're trying to prevent it So that this poor dog that comes every two weeks doesn't have to go through that every time she made it seem like exactly that like Just listen, you know, there's a lot to be learned here 
and I can learn something, you guys can see and learn something, and you guys know now what to look for, right? Mm -hmm. I have, and I'm ready to take you guys on the next outing. <laughs> Who did that 50? I think I said thank you. Is Dawn? Oh, Lillian. Lillian Ward. Lillian, Lillian Ward, Ward thank you for the 50. For the 50. I, I think I scrolled and said that. But 107 of you guys, um, smash the like button. If you're hating and you don't like it, smash the dislike button. Thanks for helping us grow, being a part of what we do. Thanks for the donations to the feed. I'll pay you to send David <laughs> to help her out. <laughs> David, you're going to need a face mask if you go in there. Uh, yeah. I am. My dad always told me cheap turns out to be expensive. Can you really afford this? Pay it forward. Love you guys a lot. You should have told that lady how dangerous it is to use straps around the abdomen. She didn't exactly. That's why I brought up the dog up stand. You notice I wasn't in there to sell anything. I was in there to find a place to pay them to groom out of. Much love, San Diego. Okay, we love you guys. Last minute donations. Everyone donate a dollar. Help the feed. Please and then it, I think a lot of you loved us walking in on these people and asking for their permission to continue recording. If they said no, we would walk out. So we really appreciate you guys loving it. And if you want to see more people, more things like this, and I know you do, man, I know you guys were like, where are we going now? <laughs> Thank you guys. Our, my favorite groomer family is the best, you, especially after that post you see on Facebook about the dog dying. Oh my goodness. Enjoy the stream. Thank you guys. Love you guys. Have a great day. So Enjoy your life. You guys enjoyed it. Yeah, it's David. David's new. really happy. Like, it's, it is new. It's definitely new. It's and I said, new. we tried. When let's we go do things, this. When we try new new things on the channel, I get nervous. I'm like, they're not gonna like it. They're not gonna like it. Yeah. Make sure you share it. Okay. Just be like, hey, you guys. D is gonna walk in on you in California. Be ready. <laughs> so if you guys are groomers out there and don't want us to walk in and what? See some stuff, you guys better have Better fix it. You have an opportunity right now to see what you saw, get your own opinion of it, and then do what you need to do in your own facility. Because number two, that salon was on point. That salon was on point, number two. So we'll be back, mm -hmm. number two. And I uh, love you guys. Thanks for being here. We appreciate you. Thanks, thanks, guys. Bye. 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 I don't know how to hear. Yeah, but it's, all, it's all stuck over here. Okay.